What's going on everybody? I am back with another video and today we're all going to be playing Squid Games in real life and all these people behind me right now are going to be participating in all the same kid games that they played in the actual Squid movie. So just like in the movie, we're going to have a lot of the same games like Red Light, Green Light, Tug of War and many more and once someone loses the game, Bam, they're out. They're totally done. They have no chance of winning the money. But the one winner at the end will be winning a money prize. So I legit think this is going to be my best challenge I've ever had on my channel. And now without further ado, it is time to start the Squid Games in Real Life Challenge. <laughs> Everyone chose to risk their lives for some money. It is time to start challenge number one. So now for challenge number one, just like in the movie, the first one was red light, green light. I will be up on the balcony of the building behind, um, in front of them, behind me right now, yelling out red light, green light. And whenever I yell green light, everyone can move. And there's a milestone that everyone is trying to get to over there. And once you guys reach that milestone, you are safe. But there's a two minute and 30 second timer to reach that. And if I catch anybody moving after I say red light, they're automatically out and done for the entire Squid Games in real life. I'm on the top deck and it is time to start. On the count of three, three, two, one, green light. Red for tug of war so in tug of war there's going to be multiple teams that are going to be going up losers are out winners move on to the next game so i'm going to be calling numbers it's going to be teams of three all the teams have been created for tug of war totally at random it's not their choice after all they're here to win some money so guys may i please have team number one and team two step up here we have Team number one, team number two, when I say go, you guys will start and try to pull the other onto your side past this. Three, two, one, go! Oh no, oh no, it's Go, 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 go! Team number two is officially eliminated. Let's do it. Team number three, team number four, when I say go, guys, in three, two, one. Oh, Holy cow! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That is it for team number three. Okay, in three, two, one. Tug of War, but we have these two right here who did 
not play. And if you guys are wondering why, that is because just like when everyone signed up, I went through my files and they had such athletic backgrounds that they would have won no matter what. And it would be pointless for them to go. So you guys automatically move on. You may proceed. Now the challenge number two is over. We are moving on to the third challenge and we are back at home now since it got so dark outside. And for this one, this is like the one in the actual Squid Games where there were two different paths of glass to step on. And each time it looks like this basically. I'd build this on the ground. So it would be like one glass there, another glass there, and you'd have to jump to the next one. And on these two paths, there was always one side that was tempered glass and one that wasn't. So one was safe, you wouldn't fall. And then if you stepped in the one that wasn't safe, the person would fall through to their death. And this time, not actually falling to death, but under each of these pieces of paper is an X or a check mark. So people are trying to choose the right one and get all the way through. And the first person to go will have the biggest advantage because the, everyone else is going to be able to watch. And that's just how the movie works. Okay, here's the first person for challenge number three. You may go now. Okay, we have to check. It's an X! for the second person to go. That one is a check mark. Okay. Which one? This one? An X. You're safe. Oh. Yeah, That one. You're safe. Oh, 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 my god. oh my god. That one. Oh no. You're gone. Oh no. No. It's the fourth person's turn. You may go now. I can't remember. That one. You must check. You got it. Oh, yes. Woo. <laughs> you're safe. All right. Oh. That one. Let's see. Oh. You are safe. Oh. Oh. Yes. All right. I'm just saying, according to the show, they get you. That one. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. yeah. Oh. yeah. Oh. Which one next? You must check. No! <laughs> it is the fifth person's turn now. This one. You got it! Yeah. Choose your next one. You got it! You may choose the next one. The, this one? You got it! Wow! Okay! What is next? You think this one. Okay. You got it! Okay! This is it! If you get this right, you are done. And you move on to, to the next round. Three, two, one! It is the sixth person's turn. This one. You are safe. This one. You are safe. This one. You got it. You're moving on. This one, you got it. Holy cow. And last one, will we make it? This one, you got it.
You got it. This one, you got it. Last two. This one, you got it. This one, can you make yeah. it? Yeah. The last person for round number three. It is your turn. This one. Yes! You did it! And now we are ready for what might be the actual last round. We have the last four remaining people right here. And for this one, we are doing the honeycomb game from Squid Game. So everybody has a piece of honeycomb with a heart cut out of it. Or not fully cut out, but engraved in it. And everyone will be using their toothpick. Everybody has their own toothpick they're going to try to use to cut out the shape. And whoever can successfully cut out the heart without breaking it, without the heart in the middle cracking, will win this round. And if there's only one person, they win the whole thing. And if nobody does it, we go to a tiebreaker. You guys may start in three, two, one, go. This is what you do, <laughs> You may do whatever you want, as long, but if it cracks, you're gonna lose. <laughs> If you, you must have a heart cut out. Like the movie. See how you guys are doing. Cooper's getting the jacks to make progress. My toothpick's just gone. Oh shit, look at this, look at this. What, Jack? What? Here. Oh, 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 Jack no ass. Jack. Good? You are good. His cracked. I am sorry, but you are out. Bam. Oh, why is it possible right now? We had the last round go underway, and three of the four remaining people were not successful at cutting out the honeycomb heart. And I feel for them because I do not know at all what it would have been like to be in that challenge. I really don't. But just like in the movie, they have just been competing to get their money to pay off their debts. And now the final winner will be receiving his gift card for his prize. You may step forth, winner. Woo! It's a GameStop gift card. For how much? $500. What? Let's go. Now, what do you think you might use this for? Probably, I'm probably going to get some V-Bucks. Some V-Bucks on Fortnite? Yeah, Fortnite. Let's go. I really hope, I really hope you appreciate your prize, man. I do, I you do. You deserved it. After winning all those games, they were so hard. You really deserved it. But now that the challenge is over, it is time to wrap up today's video. So, this was probably the most people, well, it was the most people I ever had in a video. And now that the challenge is over, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me be the boss of the Squid Games in Real Life Challenge. And most importantly, I just really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So if you did, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and I will see all of you in the next video. Peace! Bye.